Guys, listen to this. Uh -huh. Inside of your clique of 12 friends, you call your guys. Uh -huh. and there are smaller cliques within that circle. Uh -huh. Now, three guys are having issues with the other three guys. Two guys are saying the other two guys are proud. It, do, it only takes the spirit of discernment to see this. Now, if you accidentally become successful, if you eventually become successful before your friends, you are in trouble. More cliques will be formed amongst your ranks, leading to silent grudges, you know, backstabbing, gossip, and everything. Always keep your guys informed, keep them updated, update your guys once you achieve success. Like, look, guys, in life, you are not in a competition with your guys. I need you to, I need you to understand. You are in a competition with yourself, you are not in a competition with your guys. Be genuinely happy for people. When they win, whether they are in your clique or they are not in your clique, be happy for people. Always aim to beat your own previous record, not to beat your guy's record. If your friend lets you down and later apologizes, embrace him or her wholeheartedly. In this present world, guys, guys really apologize to you. A wise man once said, Keep your friends close, what? but keep your enemies closer. I have to do, I don't know what in, I don't know what in. Now, if I invite you to my party, it may not necessarily be that you're my friend. It's just that I'm trying to keep you close for a reason. Sometimes I trust my enemies more than my friends because I know what my enemies can do, but I do not know the worst my friends can do. So I keep my enemies closer. I don't want my friend, I don't know what my friend could be saying behind my back. Only the wise can actually survive this fake world. What? Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video. I love you all.